So we've got England Denmark tonight. We've got another international friendly. What are we going to learn from this game? Tonight we're lining up with your Steven Gerrard, your Wayne Rooney, your Dan Sturridge. Definitely going to the Rio World Cup. We don't need to be playing them. Why not have a look at your Carrolls up front, your Hendersons in midfield. Luke Shaw, Luke Shaw's on the bench. We're going to be playing Ashley Cole. He's had over 100 caps. What do we gain from seeing Ashley Cole for another 45 minutes? Chris Morlin. Why is Chris Morlin even in this squad? Who wants to see Chris Morlin in an England shirt? Because it ain't me. And I... Oh. <laughs> people out there who are actually very interested in seeing people like Luke Shaw play. I know he's not the same position, but it's the same principle. We're going to start an experienced veteran there, but we're going to play Chris Morlin, who hopefully is a no-hoper for the Rio World Cup. Tonight, the players I'd rather see starting, I'd rather see either Andy Carroll or Ricky Lambert on the pitch, because they're the other option. They're the big guy, they're the target. If we need the goal in the last 10 minutes, we're going to be throwing one of them on. Let's see who's, better, who's, who's the better option. Wayne Rooney's going to be there. Get rid of Dan Sturridge. Why not have a look at who's better in midfield for a second choice? Henderson, not Tom Cleverley. Don't know why he's in the squad either. United players this season, apart from Wayne Rooney, not interested. Just want to leave you with this to think about. Do you really think we're gaining anything tonight that we didn't already know?